Well, guys, it seems Fiona Bruce, otherwise known as the Camel's Hoof, presented Newsnight yesterday and naturally had to talk about the sexual deviance within the BBC. This on its own is funny enough, but we had a little Freudian slip or outright revolt against BBC management stopping presenters throwing out names. Quite simply, it's about trust. Your trust in the BBC, funded by you through the licence fee. Trust in its high-profile names. <laughs> We do know the BBC is in the middle of another crisis and big questions are being asked again about who, who knew what when and why the corporation is on the back foot. <laughs> about who, who knew what when and why the corporation is on the back foot. What has it learned from previous crises? Nothing, nada, zip. Now, given speculation and pictures doing the rounds online, a little fumble with dumb words there is what many are calling a Freudian slip because, as I've said previously, they all know who this person is and without question have known since the bloody start. Her dropping that, whether it be accidental or intentional though, is likely going to get her in a lot of shit because the BBC have been doing their best to keep it under wraps even if online speculation is bloody rife. Now, another thing that adds weight to this being a Freudian slip is the fact that not one single media outlet have reported on this when normally there would be several. I wonder why that is. But what do you guys think? Do you think it's a Freudian slip or do you think this BBC Trout's rebelling against BBC Top Brass who have been accused of protecting this guy at the expense of others? I mean, a few BBC presenters who got linked with all this have become very salty about it and even threatened to sue the so-called right-wing trolls they're blaming for it. What a wanker. Pan the pan the pandemic. Where are